Hi everybody, so I've been doing some videos on this junk converter line to summon shooting Majestic Star Dragon. I already did two videos before. I've been testing with this deck a lot and since I came up with that line I was really excited and I saw that that line had so much potential. And then I posted those videos. Leo was so nice of him to watch the video and he made me realize that I was basically cheating. <laughs> I was doing a play with Axel Synchron that was not allowed since he had his effects negated. So now I tested with this variant for a day and now I have a new combo line that is not illegal and we still summon Shooting Majestic Star Dragon. I'm gonna show you this combo line with Junk Converter. As I said on the previous one, this is a popular combo line since you just need to draw this one and any tuner and then you have access to Junk Synchron. I think the least useful is gonna be Junk Synchron in hand since in this combo line we need the three Junk Synchrons. So I'm gonna show you, you're gonna see why you need three Junk Synchrons. You'll start with these two cards and any card that we're gonna need for a discard. So let's start. Junk Converter, discard any tuner in hand so we can add Junk Synchron. Then we will Normal Summon Junk Synchron and we will revive Junk Converter. Then we'll Synchro 5 for Junk Speeder and we'll do Chain 1, Chain 2. Revolve Junk Synchron, Stardust Synchron, Junk Synchron, Jet Synchron. Effect of Stardust Synchron to add Arriving Light. We'll activate the Arriving Light, we'll put Converging Wheels in the top of our deck, and now we'll Synchro 8 for Crystal Wind. Then we'll trigger Arriving Light's effect to draw, draw and reveal Converging Wheels, and by the effect of Converging Wheels, we'll summon Brotar. With Brotar, we can target Junk Synchron to discard and add Double Warrior to hand. Now that we have Double Warrior, we're gonna do a Synchro 5 for TG Hyper Librarian. We can activate Start of Synchron Effect and Grip, Tribute Junk Synchron, Special Summon, and now trigger Double Warrior's effect in hand to Special Summon itself. Now we have enough to make Shooting Majestic Star Dragon, and we'll do Chain 1, Chain 2, Double Warrior, Special Tokens, and draw a card. Now we can do Synchro 5 and we'll go for Axel Synchron, Chain 1 to draw a card. I'm gonna dump Start a Synchron to reduce this by 4. So now this is level 1 and we can use any of these tuners to do Shaman. But I like to use Jet after because I want to chain block other effects. And now we'll do Chain 1, Chain 2 to revive these level 2s and draw a card. Synchro 5 with Jet Synchron Double Wear and Junk Converter for Garden Rose Maiden. So now we'll do Chain 1, Chain 2 to add, Chain 3 to add one Junk card from our deck, Chain 4 to Special Tokens. So this is the reason why uh, we'll need the three Junk Synchrons. The first one to Normal and do Synchro 5, the second one to special from speeder and this one is the third one to our hand. So we'll do tokens, junk synchron, block garden and draw. And this is really essential for the for this line. If you already had in hand, that's better. But if you don't have access to this in hand, then you can use overtake. You're already gonna draw a lot of cards, so I won't be surprised if you'll have it in hand. So now, synchro three. Marshall Metal Marcher, chain 1, chain 2, to revive John Synchron from the grave. And we'll draw another card. Okay, so this is where the line starts to do some crazy funny things. And if you have Overtake or Stardust Illumination, you can vary. This time we are not going to do like three different lines. We're just going to do this line that if you have different extenders, then you can do different stuff. So in this case, before using Black Garden, we're gonna do Synchro 4, Herald, Chain 1, we draw. So now we're gonna activate Black Garden and then use the effect of Arriving Light, the second effect. We're gonna activate Black Garden, Synchro 8 for Omega, and the chain will be Chain 1 to draw a card, Chain 2 to create a token, Chain 3 to special a tuner from hand. I can special this, 
create a token and draw a card. And since we did another special summon, we can trigger this effect again to create a token in the opponent's field. We'll destroy these tokens so we can revive Garden Rose Maiden. And now we can use the effect of Omega. We'll break a card from an uh, opponent's hand. We can go for Axel Sync on Stardust Dragon. Chain 1, Chain 2, we'll revive Shaman and we'll draw a card. We have access to any Synchro 10 here. I like to do Synchro Stardust Dragon and with the Stardust Dragon and Shaman we'll do another Synchro 10 for Bestial Dispatter and we'll draw two cards. One, two. We can activate the effect of Dispatter to bring back Omega and Omega reap another card from our opponent's hand. So this would be the end of our line. We drew one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cards that can be extenders, more interruptions, hand traps, uh, depending on your build. In this case, I have Stardust Illumination as extender. I have Gamma, and it depends on what you play. You have Overtake if you need it, uh, Junk Synchron in hand, or if you need to extend or do something different, this can help you. An extension that you can do in this case is Stardust Illumination. Since you have this card on the field that lists Stardust Dragon, you can special summon Stardust Synchron from the deck. And now I can use the Stardust Illumination, the Grave, Banish, Target Stardust Synchron, increase this by one, and now it's 10, we'll do Baron. So the only card that we have left is Junk Warrior, uh, but that's okay. We have a lot of negates. We did a lot of draws and you can even use the effect of Garden Rose Maiden and the Grave to banish and you can revive a Crystal Wing. You can do Stardust Dragon, Axel Synchro Stardust Dragon. If you need another negate, Destruction Negate. I really like to keep this for the next turn since if they break this board, Maybe you negate with this. This is gonna come back. Omega is gonna come back. You can negate with this. Maybe they destroy this. If they did not won on that turn, you can next turn banish this. And if they did had a kaiju for this, you can revive this. Or you can revive even this pattern and then recycle card in Rose Maiden. So you have a, a lot of options. I like this card. It gives a different kind of route for us. I used to only use it on the double line but since i was cheating i decided to go for this line and i really really liked it so that would be the first line let's try and do uh the second line so this instead of being in like a different line it's gonna just show you that you can use overtake and illumination as different extenders to get to almost the same board. For example, if you already use Junk Converter and Stardust Synchron at the start of the duel to get to Junk Synchron, you're not gonna be able to use Illumination to bring Stardust Synchron from deck and then have Baron as the end of the combo. There's where Overtake can help us. Stardust Illumination can still grab a Stardust Trail of the field and then it's a thing for you to play with and see how you can get to different boards with these cards. So I'm gonna show you just one example with the Overtake. If you already drew Overtake, you can go for a really similar line. You're gonna draw less cards, but you're gonna still be able to get to Herald, uh, Dispatter, uh, Baron, and Shooting Majestic. So let's try it. Now we'll do Synchro 3 for Marcher, Gen 1, Gen 2. Since we don't have Stardust in deck that we can Extend. So this time, instead of bringing Junk Synchron from the graveyard, we're gonna bring Axel Synchron. And now, what we can do is we're gonna activate Black Garden and we're gonna Synchro 8 for Omega. We'll do Chain 1, Chain 2, Chain 3 to Special Junk Synchron. Special Black Garden will put a token here. Chain 1, draw a card. And now, since we special another monster, we can do chain one again and we'll bring another token. I ran out of tokens, so... <laughs> so we're gonna have two tokens here. Now we can proceed to use Omega, Banished, and Tribute a Garden with the two tokens to special summon again Garden Rose Maiden. And now we have access for Synchro Tent, we're on here, Hero. We'll draw two cards for each one. And now with Overtake, we drew one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One of them being Overtake. So you can activate Overtake, revive Jump Synchron, and now you have access for Axel Synchro Stardust Dragon, revive Shaman, and 
you still this power. You can still go for a status dragon, and this card can have three attacks on the next turn. But since you don't have Hyper Librarian and you're not, not gonna troll off of it, then um, you can still go for it. Yeah, I think you can still go for it and go for uh, this pattern. Then this pattern can bring back Omega and rip another card from, from your opponent's hand. So now you have almost the same end board just because you had overtaking hand. And it can still apply to Illumination bringing Starter's Trail, but you have to see where can it be helpful. So yeah, this would be this combo that is, I hope is not a deagle. <laughs> I hope Leo sees this video and can tell me what do you think. I think it's really good. You draw a lot of cards, you draw seven cards, and you end on a really decent board. Uh, this can be hand traps, more interruptions. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you, thank you for watching.